We put the aerosol paint into the girls' hands and we let them on the wall and the excitement from being able to test out the caps and test out the pressure and test out how this um, new material to them is going to hit the wall. There was no stopping them. It seemed like a cool new art I've never experienced before. I want to like broaden my horizons. It was like hesitancy because you didn't want to mess up and it was a bit you know, scary in front of everyone else, but we got there and it, it turned out good. Public art represents unity, and I think when somebody walks by this, they can tell that multiple people have created such a beautiful piece, and it makes the city a lot more interesting. Especially for um, marginalized communities, if they, um, it can give them a sense of safety to see something they relate to, and see that there's someone out there representing them. I feel so optimistic when I see such a talented, motivated, collaborative group of young people who can work together to create something so beautiful. It's really important for Girls Mural Camp to exist because we really want to give young artists an opportunity to learn new skills, to collaborate, especially during COVID, to come together with other people after being online and digital for so much of the year. Girls Mural Camp in itself provides a really supportive environment in a traditionally really male-dominated field. The here they're working with people their own age, they're learning from amazing female mentors, and it just creates a really supportive and wonderful environment for them. 